Let me make sure this works first. There we go. Since it's the seasons, I'm about to light my holiday candle. The light, yep, there we go. Christmas cookie. This candle on its last leg though, but I'm gonna make it work. Merry Christmas, y'all. Hi, I'm Tasi, and welcome back to my channel. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome home. And if you're a new subscriber, make yourself at home by clicking that subscribe button. I had a feeling that some of y'all was doing some really, really, really last minute Christmas shopping. And I'm not gonna lie to y'all, like for me too, like pretty much my whole family, this Christmas is just like, as far as gifts go, it's really not gonna be all that. I'm more of a gift giver than a gift receiver anyway, so for me, it makes no difference. But I feel like everybody is just kind of in that mood now. Like everybody's just kind of in that mindset, like Christmas this year is going to be very cheap. It's too much going on, child, too much. But I figured there's enough people out there that don't know what to get for Christmas or just don't have the pockets for it. So of course your girl had to come through and help you guys out. So today I'll be showing you guys all the cheap gifts that you can get for Christmas. All of these are reasonable, all of these are practical, and depending on the person, they'll love that way more than any other expensive stuff that you thought they were gonna like. So if you're interested, stay tuned. And with that being said, let's get straight into the video. So the first best cheap Christmas gift is of course, candles. You can never go wrong with the candle, I'm telling you, you can't go wrong with candles. I'm the type where I like a lot of smell good stuff, so you know, I have an oil diffuser, I got candles, I got, listen, spray, like I need to smell good. I need my space to smell beautiful. If you go to Bath and Body Works, they always have like $5 candles, $10 candles. Now I will say, just personal bias, just, just a personal bias. I do like Yankee Candle way more than I like Bath and Body Works but i can say that as far as like the size of the candle you can definitely stretch a dollar way way further at bath and body works than at yankee because even though yankee has like cheap candles as well the five dollar ten dollar candles they look like the candle i just lit super duper tiny and i don't know who you're talking to or who you're dealing with maybe they will just appreciate it off rip like i don't know for me the bigger the candle the better but again, it's all about your person. But either way, you go to Bath and Body Works, you go to Yankee, you go anywhere else, candles are always cheap. They're always cheap. They're always usually on sale around this time. I'm telling y'all, just get a candle. Just get a candle. Nobody is going to be mad about a candle. The second best cheap gift, get a bath set. You can find bath sets at TJ Maxx, Marshalls. There's even some at the dollar store. Now I will say me, I have sensitive skin, so I can't just put any and everything on my body. But when I tell you I have bath stuff for days because my family, everybody get a bath set. I kid you not, I'm pretty sure this was from 2020. Like I'm, I'm pretty sure that this was from like three going on. Is it about to be four years? It is. Wow, so yeah, I got this back in 2020. I still have it because I've been using all the other bath stuff that I've been using. And I got like a whole thing of like, I, I don't feel like going to get it, y'all. I don't feel like going to get it. But it's a whole thing of just this big gigantic body wash. I don't think you can ever go wrong with body wash either because like I showed y'all, I don't use bath bombs, but it comes with a bath bomb. It comes with a loofah. I don't even use loofahs no more. I discovered African sponges never went back but look you got your body wash you got your bubble bath you got body cream all of this and this was probably like i don't know exactly where this came from but i guarantee you this was probably like less than 20 dollars. that's nothing and it's a practical gift because who don't wash up you better be washing up don't you come to christmas funky that's nasty the third best cheap gift obviously food Food is like one of the best gifts in my opinion, cause you know I like to eat. But food is like the top tier gift to give. You need food to live and food tastes good. Why not get food? And if you need some ideas, cookies, muffins, candy. And I never tried to make my own, but hot chocolate bombs, those are like what? I don't wanna lie, but I wanna say like $10 a piece. They're all useful all of them they taste good they're like you know a part of the holidays and what if it's just like a christmas party your gift can just be the food that come on now you ain't gotta pay for a caterer you don't have to go to the to the bakery and ask nobody for nothing you just got it 
That's the best thing ever. I don't know. I, I like food, so I would appreciate it. I would. Now the fourth cheap gift idea, it's a classic. It, it literally is a classic. Handmade gifts will always be top tier. I'm a sucker for sentimental stuff. If you write me a letter, I'm a fold. I am, I'm a fold. You draw me a picture, even if you're not the best drawer, love it. There's just nothing like something that was done with somebody's hands and made out of love. Like that is just the best thing ever. So literally, if you wanna make a card, that works. You can make ornaments like how we used to do when we were younger. My mama still got my ornament from when I was in like first grade. It's Rudolph made out of a pine cone. Like, it's too cute. And then recently on TikTok, I seen that there were people making homemade snow globes. Now that, what? You, you get me something like that? Oh my God. I would just be the happiest person in the world. I'm thinking about doing it with my family this upcoming Christmas. Cause I seen some Hello Kitty figurines. Don't tempt me, I might. And if I do, I'ma show y'all. So follow me on Instagram so you can see it. But I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'd love it. Fifth good cheap gift idea for Christmas. Some people might be divided on this part, but that's okay. Some really good socks. Let me tell you something. I'd be so happy when I get those comfy socks. Cause they not just any socks. I'm, I'm not talking about any socks, okay? I'm talking about the type of socks where they just so, Fuzzy. I don't know if that's yarn. I don't know if that's wool. I don't know what that is, but them real puffy socks. I love it. I love it so much. Those are actually the types of socks that I use when I get out the shower and I like try to give myself like a fake pedicure because those you put a whole bunch of lotion on your feet and then put them socks on. Heaven. Heaven, I'm telling you. And on the cold days, perfect. Honey, the way I do not miss going to school during a snow day. Oh, I don't miss that at all. I used to be layered up and then I would put them socks on with some Uggs. Feet be sweating and stinking by the time you get home, but baby, you gonna be warm, I'm telling you. I seen some of those types of socks at Kroger's and they had them for like, I think it was like five pairs for like $7. Probably even lower than that because it was in a bargain bin, so I don't really remember. But yeah, like those are cheap. Always get them type of socks. I'm telling you, can't go wrong with it. So the sixth best cheap idea, slippers. Slippers. I'm like, come on now. Again, TJ Maxx, Marshalls. And like I said, the bath sets, there are certain bath sets, those might cost a little bit more though, but there are certain bath sets where they come with slippers. Get your person a slipper. I think Old Navy be having them for cheap too, like probably $5 a piece. I could be lying, but I'm telling you, slippers? I need some new slippers. I almost bought myself some, but I'ma chill out because I think somebody's buying me some. But yeah, y'all, slippers, socks, all of that. Anything that goes on your feet and warms your feet up when it's cold outside, you can't go wrong with that. There is nobody on this earth that's gonna sit there and feel disrespected for you buying them that, I'm telling you. Now, if you wanna be fancy and get them like Ugg slippers and stuff like that, perfectly fine, but we talking about the cheap stuff. We broke right now, so we, we not, we not looking at that. We're looking at these. We, we, we staying over here. But either way, slippers is the way to go, especially the ones that are like socks. Oh, I need to buy me some more of those because that was good. Those were good. So number seven for cheap Christmas gifts. Y'all gonna laugh at me. Y'all gonna laugh at me. But whatever you can find in the dollar bin at Target, listen to me, hear me out. That dollar bin, you be getting distracted by it. It be a whole lot of nonsense that you do not need. But there's certain stuff in there where it's like, it really is useful. Like stationary stuff, little water bottles and spray bottles and all of that. I'm telling you, just, just, go, just go to that dollar bin and just make a gift basket. I kid you not, make a gift basket. Cause again, if it's handmade, it's usually gonna be better than any materialistic item that you can find. So you get them a whole bunch of stuff from the dollar bin and put it in like a nice little basket and the baskets you can get those at Dollar Tree for a dollar. So, you know, don't knock it till you try it. Cause I know y'all gonna doubt me. I know y'all gonna be looking at me like, girl, what are you talking about? I'm telling you, dollar bin at Target. Dollar bin at Target. Number eight for the cheap gifts. I just found this out recently. Do you know how cheap board games are today? I guess it's because don't nobody play it for real no more, but they got some cheap board games at five below. It costs $5 or below for a game of Monopoly. Even with that, that's something good too. You get those little card games, the little board games. Not only is it something to do for if you guys have like a Christmas party, but it's something that people are gonna pick up because I love me some Monopoly. Me and my family be fighting over Monopoly. We do, we do. 
but Monopoly, Trouble, The Game of Life, I ain't played The Game of Life in a minute. All of these things are really good. They're always fun to do. And then I don't know where y'all live at, but I live in one of those areas where if it's a really bad storm, the power go out. So one of the worst things you can do is be bored when the power's out. So you get you a little flashlight and y'all play board games? Ugh, come on now. Number nine, another practical cheap gift, blankets. Blankets have to be the best gift ever. I swear to God, it has to be the best gift ever. So that cover that you always see at the foot of my bed, you would think that that's like a duvet. Baby, that's a blanket. I made it a duvet because I felt like it. And that's not the only blanket that I have. I'm about to go show y'all. Hold on. Honey, I stay with a blanket. So this one, this one is like a rainbow zebra looking thing. I don't know where somebody got this from, but I know it was cheap. It had to be like probably at most $5, probably. Y'all don't judge me. I don't feel like putting this stuff back up. So I'm gonna just throw it on my bed. <laughs> Y'all know I'm not dirty. And then this one, I used to love, oh, love this when I was a child. This princess blanket. One thing I love about this princess blanket, I'm about to show y'all. You can turn it into a bag. Like it goes within itself. So when it's time to put it up, boom. You don't know how often I use this one. This one is thicker than that one, but I swear that one keeps me way warmer than this one. And I feel like it's because I've been using it for so long. I've had this since like I was nine. You cannot go wrong with a blanket. Can't go wrong with a blanket. Nice shot. So number 10 for the cheap gift ideas, a stuffed animal or particularly a Squishmallow. You don't have to get the super big gigantic ones, but there's some at five below. A teddy bear, a bunny, whatever the animal is, as long as it is fluffy and as long as it's stuffed. Y'all probably can't see them cause it's dark, but you know, I, I stay with my Hello Kitties. If you can see, there's a new addition. She's the smaller one. I actually had that small one for some years, but see, when my sister was born, she tried to be like me, no joke. She tried to be like me and she tried to have an obsession with Hello Kitty, but she don't like Hello Kitty no more. So I took my stuffy back. I did, I don't feel bad about it. But anyways, back on track, I stay with a plushie, especially if it's Hello Kitty. Are you kidding me? Y'all should know that by now. Honestly, I don't know a girl that wouldn't want a stuffed animal. It don't have to be a Build-A-Bear, it don't have to be nothing fancy, but a stuffed animal. And if it's Christmas themed, listen, listen. I'm a sucker for sentimental stuff, so you know. That works for me. But seriously, I don't feel like you can go wrong with a stuffed animal. It's like the cheapest way to show that you care about somebody. And the last addition on this list, it sounds weird, but again, very practical. And I'm the type of person where I like pretty things. I like intricate designs and things that are different. And even if it's something little, if I don't have to pay for it, I'll take it 100%. So the last best cheap idea on my list is a phone case. I know it's weird, but I'm telling you, a phone case, it don't even have to be an OtterBox, just something cute. It's a million and one online boutiques out there where they sell phone cases. Again, five below, Dollar Tree, pretty sure they got some on Amazon. It's just so many options. A practical and creative gift. Oh, that's another thing that you can hand make yourself too. You can just get a clear one and then just like glue all these little figurines and stuff on it. Oh, that's a good idea. But yeah, phone cases are not only cute, but they protect your phone. Everybody needs a phone case. Anybody that has a phone needs a phone case. So why not get them a phone case? And again, if I don't have to go out of my way and buy it, bet, <laughs> bet. So guys, that is the end of my video. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Hopefully this was useful to you because by the time you're seeing this, it is Christmas Eve, so Merry Christmas. I hope you were able to get everybody a gift this year. I hope you're surrounded by love and kindness. I hope you eat some really good food. So before you go, don't forget to like this video. Comment down below if you have any other ideas for cheap Christmas gifts that I did not mention in this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you're not subscribed. And of course, share if you can. So with that being said, Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. But you won't.